Hey, I'm back with some great news for small enterprise or ISP network administrators. I know that many of you are using the CRS212 in your fiber setups, but it's been what, six, seven years? I think we can all agree it's time for an upgrade. With a modern CPU, four times the RAM, double the switching capacity, better cooling, the list goes on. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you the CRS310. This switch is a variation of the Netfiber 9, but for indoor applications. You're getting the powerful ARM v7 CPU, 256 megabytes of RAM, and 10 ports in a small package. Let's take a closer look. There are five 1 GSFP ports, four 10 GSFP plus ports, and an additional gigabit ethernet port with PoE input. This gigabit ethernet port has a direct connection to the switch chip, so you can expect full speed. It's not just for management purposes. Speaking of the switch chip, the new Marvel switch chips are really fast. If we compare the test results, the performance is more than double, and we've added a fan controller for the most efficient cooling, so you can really push the hardware to its limits. When it comes to powering, the new CRS keeps on winning. It features a wider input voltage range, and there are two ways to power it, the DC jack or the PoE in port. Very handy for tight spots. Another cool addition, the One U rack mount ears. You can mount this switch in a rack to keep everything organized. And let me tell you, the switch has definitely earned its place in the rack. It supports hardware offloaded VLAN filtering and even some hardware offloaded layer 3 routing. All in all, this sounds like the perfect device for small, even medium offices or connecting buildings, small apartment complexes. 10 gigabit connection stretching way over 100 meters without annoying ping, data loss or electromagnetic interference. That's what the new CRS is all about, for the best price, of course. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe so you're always the first to know about our newest products. Contact your local magnitude distributor for more information.